Hello everybody, today I'm back, as you guys can tell from the thumbnail and the title of this video, we have another wig video for you guys, but this one is a little special because it's my birthday, what? and you can't complain about things that I do on my birthday. I've been chilling like a villain in my space now She see what I'm doing, now she in my face now Get cool with the blicky in my lawyer case now Now I'm gone on the west side But I'm on the east side Alright you guys, so before we get into the wig, I thought I would go ahead and show y'all how I pretty much dyed it. So you guys can see here, I'm doing the watercolor method. Ever since I found this out, I've been addicted. I'm never going back to the other type of hair dye I was using because that literally wasted so much time. But yeah, I get my bucket of, not bucket, like it's literally a drawer of like hot water. And then I put like a couple drops of this Adore hair dye. Literally only like two or three drops because I really did not want this to come out like too dark. And then I added some conditioner in it to kind of dilute it. And then you guys can see I'm really like making sure that it looks like a nice pink but doesn't get too dark. Because if you leave it in for too long, like it will like turn into something that you don't want it to be so here i am just checking it and then when i finally felt like it was ready i took it out put it on a towel dried it off um i washed it again just to like run some water through it get all of it out and then i blow dried it and then i styled it and i just curled it so yeah if you guys want to see the rest of it then let's keep going all right you guys so we just finished blow drying our wig. Um, who's crying? Yeah. Why are you crying? As you guys can see, it's like a super light peachy color almost. I just did literally like three drops of hair dye mixed with conditioner. And then we have like this really nice soft pink. And now we're going to go ahead and create a part. I'll do a little zoom in for you guys. As you guys can see, the scalp is already pre-plucked. It does look pretty nice. However, what I like to do, kind of just separate like the first row of hair and then I pluck a little bit more just because the poofiness will kind of be plockable if you don't get some of that out. And I'm doing like a little middle part. So we're gonna go right down the middle and separate it. Get down! So now we're going to separate this. And what I really like about this wig is that the frontal part is like really long. So it will make it like look a lot more natural. So big thank you to SNS Hair for sponsoring this video and sending me this super cute wig. So this is a 24 inch, 250% density wig, which is... It's a lot of hair, you guys. Like, it is a full head of hair. She is pre-plucked, but I did do some plucking along the part. She's really pretty. It's really nice quality hair. I colored her using the watercolor method and some Adora hair dyes, and then I just blow-dried it and styled it and curled it. So here we have the pre-plucked hairline. It also has the natural, like, already bleached knots. You're also able to make it into a high ponytail. As you guys can see, it has, like, the lace on the back here so that's really dope a little bit about sns hair on their site when you guys go to go check out some wigs i'll show you guys right over here they have like this really dope thing that i wanted to tell you guys about it's like an auction kind of so a lot of these wigs like they'll start them at like ten dollars and then you could just place your bid and keep bidding on the wigs and then if your bid like is the highest bid then you'll you will purchase the wig like your bid will be accepted it's pretty much like ebay but for wigs so i think that's really dope it gives you guys a really great opportunity to kind of get some wigs for a little bit cheaper than what you would on other sites they also do custom hairlines so if you send them a picture of like your hairline and everything they could customize the wig exactly to you also they do have a 20 dollars off coupon right now that i'll put right over here and also in the description box below so if you guys want to go ahead and go check something out i really recommend this this is the 613 24 inch 250 percent density wig and the link to it will be down below all right so we have all of our supplies here a lot of you guys were a lot of you guys are asking in my last mukbang mukbang 
I still don't know. A lot of you guys are asking what I was drinking, and I'm drinking, and I was drinking a peach green tea from Starbucks. So bomb. All right, so we have all of our supplies over here. We have wig caps, and these are from Sally's. Eco Styling Gel, Got To Be Gel, Got To Be Free Spray, Walker Tape Ultra Hold, a Little Rat Tail Comb, Rubbing Alcohol, and Time To Spare. So we're gonna start off by, as always, getting some gel, gelling down our baby hairs. So yeah, one of my extensions did <laughs> just come out. I've had them in for probably around like two and a half months. Oh my god, I look so weird. Ah. What the hell? Are these smaller than normal? Or is my head bigger? Ow. Oh my god, you guys, this was a struggle. I'm pretty sure they made their wig caps a little bit tighter because... <laughs> My head feels squished, and my head is not that big. Okay, now we're ready to spray this down. Ooh. Oh my gosh, my eyebrows literally wiped off. And we're gonna go ahead and let the blood flow back to our foreheads by cutting off the edges. You guys, I look like I just took like a fat ass nap at school. All right, so this is what we're looking like. Um, don't judge it. We still have a lot to do. So I'm gonna put some foundation around my hairline just to make it more natural. I'm using my Milani Conceal and Perfect 2-in-1 Foundation and concealer because this one is a little bit lighter than my skin tone. We're gonna go along here and brush this around and I also apply it down the middle of my hairline because that's where the part on my wig is. Normally my whole wig process takes me around like 30 to 40 minutes. The very first time I like really laid a wig was in my rainbow wig tutorial. I'm pretty sure that's still up. You guys can see like I've gotten better and everything. So it took me like about a year to kind of really get the hang of it. And it took me a lot of wigs, like a lot of practice really. Now we're gonna go ahead and get ready to set our wig, which I'm so excited for. I'm gonna tie this into like a little half up, half down. Oh, I just snatched myself. I look like I just scalped somebody, bro. That is not okay. Now we're getting our wig glue. This is the Walker Tape Ultra Hold. I still have to try the Bold Hold wig glue because that's something that all like everybody uses. Something that I hate, or not like hate, but something that like really bugs me, really grinds my gears, or really, you know, irritates the fuck out of me, is when I'm stating my opinion on Twitter, just, you know, living my life, and then people want to come in and start arguing, and then there go little girls that follow me, not little girls, but like, there go the little girls that follow me and go like, shady tweets towards me and i'm just like but i thought you were i thought you were a fan like i don't i don't understand all right you guys so i just wrapped up my head and then i let that sit for like 25 minutes and then i went ahead and took it off and this is what we're looking like i feel like i put the wig a little bit like further behind my hairline so my forehead does look a little bit bigger I guess we're just having a big forehead today. And then I'm just combing out the curls again. I think I need to recurl this side because since I did it like on the wig head, I forgot to turn the curls. So it looks a little weird. That's about it for the whole hair look. If you guys want to go ahead and check this wig out and all the wigs from SNS Hair, then go ahead and click the link down below. Make sure you use the coupon and make sure you guys check out their whole auctioning thing. I'm pretty sure you guys would be able to get a wig for an affordable price. Alright, so I kind of skipped ahead because I forgot how to multitask. Um, 
so I don't know how to do um, I don't know how to talk and do my makeup yeah so right now we're just using the Huda Beauty palette I just got like this little rose gold look using Teddy Paw and Crave oh raw <laughs> first I'm gonna use this little Morphe brush this is the Morphe M514 and I'm going in with Teddy and we're putting this right into our crease but yeah, I do have a couple updates for you guys. My hoodies are back. Well, not right now, but they were back and they sold out. <laughs> if you guys didn't know, I do have like merch or like a clothing line. I finally opened it back up. I just dropped hoodies. I am going to be dropping more items, especially for the winter time coming up. It's cold as fuck outside, so I'm really excited. I'm thinking beanies, hoodies, all that good jazz. And lashes are still coming, by the way. We're still working on that. As for the hoodies, if you guys ordered one, thank you guys so much. It really does mean a lot to me. Like, I don't really want to get too into it because I might cry, but... And it means a lot to me because, you know, this is your guys' money. Like, this is what you guys work for. This is what, like, if you ask your parents, this is what your parents work for. And for you guys to spend that on something that, like, I'm making, like, it just really does mean a lot to me. And even you guys just, like, watching my videos, supporting me, like, you know, you're taking the time out of your day to, like, write me a nice comment to like watch my video, to watch my ad, like it really does mean a lot more than what you think and I'm really grateful, like I'm really thankful for all of you guys and it does mean so much to me. Okay, now I'm gonna get raw and put this in my outer third. So to everyone who ordered a hoodie, they will be shipping out November 8th. We're still in the process of getting all of them made because they are made to order so pretty much what I do is I set like a certain amount and then I sell those until however long they sell out and then I make all of them and then I ship them out. I don't personally make all of them. I used to but right now I just don't have the time to be making that many hoodies. Okay and I'm gonna go in with Crave and I'm getting this on like a little brush and just putting this along the inner Thirds. I'm gonna go in again with um with the same shade but like with it wet just right now I like to put it on so that I could see like what else I need to add more of. I haven't done my makeup in so long you guys so if it looks like shit that's why I used to do different makeup looks all the time like last summer but I lost inspiration. Now we're gonna dust off our under eye powder. And then I'm going to go in with a mix of Teddy and Raw for my under eye. Okie doke, now we're going to do bronzer. Alright guys, so I just finished up the whole look. That's about it for today's video. All the products will be down below. The links to my jewelry will also be down below. This one is from Bling Ting, and then this one is from Choker Jewelry. I hope you guys liked this video, even though it was a little bit all over the place. Um, this is just like my little birthday glam, um, and also how I did this wig. So if you guys go ahead and try it, go ahead and let me know. Big thank you to SNS Hair for sponsoring this video. Make sure you guys go ahead and check them out down below. You guys can see the wig is real bomb. I wish I just laid it like a little bit more down because my forehead's looking a little big, but like it, it happens sometimes. So yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. If you have any questions, leave them down below. Thank you guys all so much for the birthday love. You guys are always the best. You guys always make my day. So yeah, thank you guys and I'll see you guys next time. I've been chilling like a villain in my space now She see what I'm doing, now she in my face now Get cool with the blicky in my lawyer case now Now I'm gone On the west side